Remy, welcome to Crystal Palace Football Club. How how much are you looking forward to getting started? Yeah, definitely. Um, obviously, it's been a not long summer, but it's been a frustrating summer trying to sort something out, being being out of contract. Um, so now, obviously, can't wait to get started, and I look forward to starting this afternoon on on the grass. And you've worked with Dino before, I understand. Yeah, I worked with him at Norwich a few years back. Um, we've always stayed in touch. He's always given me advice and helped me out, and he's one of the ones that I'll always go to for for honest advice, either good or bad. So, yeah, I've got to thank Dino for for obviously getting the um, getting it over the line, and, and yeah. And he seems to create a really good spirit amongst the goalkeepers. They had a really good team last last season. Yeah, Dino's great. Um, he's obviously been in the game for so, a long time now. Um, so I want I want to obviously come in, uh, improve. I want him to Im- help me improve. I, and I've got two great goalkeepers to look up to as well with Butler and Guaita. So I can't really ask for much more, if I'm honest. And Crystal Palace, what's your experience of Palace? Um, obviously playing at a young young age when I was at Norwich. I, I played here a few times and always always tough games, always good games to, to play in. And, and, and now, like I said, it's, it's great to be a part of it and, and I'm really looking forward to it. Tell me a bit about your career since you you left Norwich City. Obviously, you came through the youth team. There. Yeah, I come through the youth team. Um, went went out on a few loans to the likes of Plymouth, um, Doncaster, Burton. Went and played in Scotland, um, and then I happened to leave Norwich to sign for Bolton on a permanent, which was a sort of tough um, experience with regards to administration and and not being paid for a long time, um, which of course obviously had an effect on on a lot of us. Um, and then after that, I happened to sign for Sunderland last year, and yeah, so obviously now I'm I'm, I'm, I'm a Crystal Palace player. We've got Patrick Vieira here as the new manager. It's, a, it's an exciting time for yeah, the club. definitely. It's exciting for everyone. There's a lot of a um, lot of speaking about the manager and, and what he's going to bring to to the to the team. And look, I think everyone's looking forward to it. And and we've just got to keep well. We've got to work hard from from last week when we first started back and. And we can come here for for a week or so and, and enjoy it and obviously work hard and, and get back to the, the winning pre season games and hopefully taking that into the season. It's a good time for you to get involved with the squad, I guess, because sometimes as a goalkeeper, if you're training on a separate part of the pitch, just coming in and then leaving the training ground, you don't see your other teammates. Mark, yeah, of course. You? Obviously, I was back, I was in on Friday, didn't really see many because I had to do my medical. And um, this is the first day I've actually been able to speak to a few of the lads, but they seem a great bunch. and. Um, this is just the start of it. So again, like I said, I'm, I'm looking forward to the to the challenge, and, and we'll see where it takes me.